prisoners to private investigators, two men who spent the last 25 years of their lives behind bars spent the day getting reacquainted with freedom and trying to plan their futures. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig shows us what it's like for the Hires brothers to be free. After 25 years in prison, Tommy Hires and his brother Raymond tasting their first full day of freedom. They went shopping for new clothes and cell phones that they had never even held. It's like leaps and bounds from, I mean, it, this wasn't out when, you know, we went in. It was like, so, yeah, it's crazy. Family and friends are now trying to teach them all about the Internet. It's fascinating just things that you can find out, anything, anything you want to find out, you can Google it, and it's just, it comes up. When the hires were released last night, the one person not there to embrace them, their mom, she died four years ago. We never had a chance to make her proud, you know. We, we owe her so much about life, and we want to just make her proud. We know she's here, she's here in spirit, and, but, yeah, it's like a shame that we couldn't come out, be something, and let her see that her boys, you know, did something with themselves and she could be proud. I hope to see myself in five years with my own home, successful, and um, I, I, me and my brother really want to um, have a business of our own. We were thinking about the, the PI business. And, uh, if it works out for us, I think that's what we'll probably be doing. But for now, it's just the things many of us take for granted, from family to even a soft bed. When I woke up, it was still dark, and I had to take a minute to figure out, you know, where I was at, and it was like, when my feet touched the floor, it hit the soft carpet, and I was like, man, we're home. In Roseville, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.